let's learn how to use the crop feature in Kittle right now. So the first thing we're gonna do is go to photos. I'm just gonna show you how easy it is to use with our photo integration here. And let's go ahead and find a photo we wanna crop like this one. I like this one because we can get a couple of different perspectives out of this, maybe get a couple different crop angles. Now, to crop the image, all you have to do is double click on the image and now you're in the crop feature, okay? This object is being cropped. All I have to do is grab one of these handles and simply drag it to where I want it to stop, maybe about right here. And you could either click out or hit exit cropping mode and it's just that simple. Look at that, we took one image that was portrait style vertical and now it is landscape horizontal then i can do it again i can just double click again and i can continue to crop this picture so boom exit crop and now we have a different kind of square style then i can crop it again and now i'm cropping in on the image so now i can see the lighthouse even better now we also have some images like vintage florals for example that we can double click in and crop because these are super high resolution png so since it is an image we can crop it okay so there we go we just exit out of that and now we can make some really cool effects for example we can make some text over here on the right and we could potentially make some crazy awesome streetwear maybe like this with petals and then i can choose a kind of streetwear-y style font like that and you can get some really cool graphics this way now another thing that you can do is crop images made with ai okay so let's go ahead and grab one of our presets here like the foggy scenery image style then we can type in a prompt and see what we get and then decide whether or not we want to crop it so i wanted a paddle and a canoe and it gave me one, but it looks like it gave me some other people up here in the top of the image, which I don't quite care for. So just double click in, grab the handle, bring it down. So now I can have this just featured on the canoe and paddle and boom, just like that, I've taken my AI generated image and created a different crop with it. Now, if you wanna see other tutorials using Kittle, I have these videos here on my right that I know you're gonna enjoy. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any upcoming videos and features and things like that. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next video.